Hi guys and welcome to this Armada Terrain video. So I've um, already done a video about pimping up the uh, the smaller tokens and I thought you know what the islands in the box they're brilliant and they're flat and they're fantastic and they're really useful if you want to however wouldn't it be cool to redeify them. <laughs> so what I've done using the templates uh, from the box I've used two halves of the four part island and then the larger island and they're going to be like coastlines so they sit around the edges um, so what I've done I've used pink insulation foam which you can pick up from Wix, B&Q um, places like that and I've cut it to shape and I've just carved a few markers in and I've used PVA glue stuck it down to the card overnight with a weight on top when that was dried I've then cut the whole thing in PVA again to give it a bit of a bit of protection and I put ballast on the top so You've joined me at the stage where I'm going to now use acrylic art paint. I'm going to paint the whole thing black. When that's dry, we're going to dry brush the, the tops with a mixture of wall paint. We're going to use oak brown and then skeleton bone. And then we're going to use a grey, which I've chosen for a standard Mechanicus grey, um, around the sides, give it a bit of a clip face look. We might drop a bit of washes on. And when we're done, we'll be using a bit of flock on the tops just to make give it the idea that this is like like the cliffs of Dover or something like that so without further ado grab your art brushes which I'm using some relatively cheap ones which you can get from a variety of, of sources so grab an art brush a nice big top on it and let's get painting And there we go. So we're uh, we're all black base coated now, which is great. So this stuff's really good, guys. It's about three quid. Um, you get loads of it. I've got loads left. Charcoal black uh, acrylic paint's really good for terrain. Uh, top tip. So it does take a little while to dry. Uh, so now we'll we'll leave it to dry. The magic of YouTube. It'll be the next second for you. Um, but once it's dry, I'm going to start my dry brushing. So I'm going to dry brush down the tops first uh, with some oak brown, followed by some skeleton bone, and then I'm going to dry brush the sides with some standard Mechanicus Grey and once that's done we'll uh, apply a few washes on there which I think I'll probably do some green and brown washes and then obviously thoroughly dry we'll be looking to paint the bases around the edges blue and then do some flocking do some water effects so sit back relax pick up the brushes let's get painting
Okay, so <clears throat> we have Tribrist of the Rock done the tops, Tribrist it again. Uh, we've added some colour variation with some washes, really brief around the bottoms here. Imagine algae building up, things like that, guys. And we've gone around a bit of agrax on the top there because obviously there wouldn't be water reaching this point. Um, and then I've done a, a simple blue colour undulation on the bases. So I'm going to let that thoroughly dry. And then we're going to flock the tops of them. We're going to flock first, which is a bit counterintuitive, but we're going to do that so it doesn't get caught in the, the resin that we're going to put on the bottom of them. Okay, so let it dry, and then we're uh, let's get flocking. <laughs> 